Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny and this is More Than A Pretty Face. And today I have a huge, huge Dollar Tree haul for y'all. But before I start, I have got to show y'all or introduce y'all to the newest member of our family. Y'all, I have been on the hunt for months, at least six months, if not longer. Um, and I got ready to leave today. And this is a funny story leading up to who I'm going to introduce you to. Um, I got ready to leave today and my son was going with me. And um, so we had gone out to the truck and all of a sudden I just started screaming. And my son's like, oh my gosh, what's wrong, what's wrong? I like scared the crap out of him. My neighbors probably thought I was like getting stabbed. But sitting in the passenger seat, already buckled in, was baby y'all meet baby walton he even has legs my husband had gone out this morning to um get some stuff that he had needed for the house and i had no idea and i had texted him and i was like did you go to the freaking warehouse where they make it for what he was going to get he was getting stuff to you know work out in the garage and he's like, no, there's bad, there was bad traffic, there was bad traffic. And I was like, okay, whatever. And so he gets home and I didn't think anything of it, finished getting ready. And then I leave. And when I get to the garage, he's just like following me out. And as soon as I open the door, I see him. And he's like sitting in the little belt in the seat belt, ready to go. So he went shopping with me and my son today. His name is Baby. He even has a little lobby. He's got his little, his little gummy frogs. Y'all, I mean, seriously. So he's gonna have his own Instagram channel for the little adventures of baby Walton. So he says hi, and he's, you'll see him a lot. I promise y'all, y'all are gonna see him a lot. It's his first little outfit. And um, like I said, he's, he's here, part of our family now. I have been waiting so long to get him, I just love him. So have y'all ever seen anything so precious in your entire life? Seriously. No, he says, no, you haven't. So this is baby Walton. He's gonna help me out today. Um, so anyways, let me just jump right into this, y'all. Okay, this is from two different stores. Um, I went to both of our stores today. And um, so I don't even know where to start. Like I've got bags here and this bag and stuff laid out. So we're just gonna jump right in. Um, first off, these, I've never seen these. I've never seen them in any other videos from any other people, but I got them for my son for his room. They are so precious. It's the, um, the best, best dog ever and it's got the little clip so that you can change the picture out and it's the plastic it's just solid white um, but it's got like the little wood grain um, and it's you know for you and your little doggy it holds a four by six and then this one um, says I love my dog and it's one that actually has the um, the back you take it out to put the picture in but it's also a four by six but they were so stinking precious I was like oh my gosh and so he, our dog, it's his dog. Lightning is actually his dog. So he would tell anybody that and Lightning would tell you that. I mean, if he had to choose who he was gonna go to, he was gonna go to Tyrus. So we got those for his room. Um, and then along the same lines, I've seen these in other videos, but I had not seen them in my store yet. And they had them today. So I went ahead and grabbed three of them, but they had the, um, the floating shelf. Um, and like I said, they're not huge, but they're so cute. And like, if you did, um, you could do like, cause I got three of them for my youngest son's room. So he can put his little, um, we're going to show them a minute in a minute. He collects the teeny boos and these are perfect cause it'll hold two of them. It'll hold two wide and you can probably put like two, four, six, you could put like eight to 10 of them on the shelf. And so I got him three of them so we can kind of stagger them along, um, along his wall and he's actually going to come down in a minute i have some that he's going to open for y'all on the video so um if your store gets these now it is a green briar product so I, I would imagine they're going to restock it's not like something they got as a um as a buyout or something from another company it is a green briar product so i'm hoping they'll keep them and maybe they'll get them in other colors like white or gray um or even like the um the peachy pink color they've been coming out with i would love that for my closet but um and it does have the mounting equipment also um to to put them in your wall so grab these if you see them because i think they're going to sell out the lady that checked me out said that she was surprised i was able to get three of them because every time i put them out they sell them out so grab them if you want them um decor i guess we'll stick with decor um they have these a bunch of these i've been seeing these in a lot of videos i had never seen this one but it's the little banks it's like a, a frame the 3d frame shadow box frame 
but it's the little bank and it says um, adventure money and it's so cute like because my kids have been telling them you know since with this whole um, COVID mess I don't even know if I'm supposed to say that all of our summer plans got changed and so now we have like we basically promised them a trip to the beach you know at some point since we didn't get to go this summer so um, we're, we're gonna let them slowly you know add their change to this and when it's filled up we'll take them to the beach so it won't take that long so I should probably get to planning but they're so cute they've got the um, like I said they've got the vacation one They've got, um, what else did they have? They had like a girls night out one. They had a date night one. They had a ton of different ones, but I thought this was the cutest and it's got the little camper with it too. So that was cute. Um, um, okay, so fabric. I've been seeing a lot more frequently. They've been carrying the, um, the like the half yards or the quarter yards have been rolled up more so along like the lines of like baby prints and you know little pink gingham and blue gingham and stuff like that y'all oh my gosh do you see this it's the lemons and it is it's crafter square and it's 20 by 21 inches so i only found one i'm going to try and find another one because I'm going to use this to um, hopefully, let's see how big it actually is, um, hopefully either make a runner, if it's long enough and I can do two of them together, or um, I'll do it to make my pillow for my chair. Um, oh yeah, I could do a runner with, if I could get two of them, um, I could cut this in half, cut the other one in half, and it would be like this times four, good size. And then I could do a solid yellow backing to it and I can make a runner for my for my table or for my um, my island in the kitchen because they have a pretty big island so for you know two packs of this would would be long enough it'd be like six eight feet so I was so excited I was I'm gonna be on the hunt though for for more um, more of it and then the other fabric I found I did I grabbed two of them because my son wants me to make him a pillow um, but it's the dogs it's the little dog print it's all the different um, i'll open it and show y'all and this is crafter square as well but it's just the little dogs and bones it is so stinking cute so i'm gonna do this and i'm gonna make him um i'm gonna make him a long um like a body pillow he has a futon in his room and so i'm gonna do uh, two of these together and then I'm going to do like a red or a, a teal solid to the back of it to do him like a body pillow to put along his futon so that'll be super cute so I did grab two of those they didn't have any solids today or else I would have grabbed them as well but I've got so much in my fabric stash that uh it you know I've got plenty of of solid background and then the other ones I found which I was super shocked again because I had just recently remember in a previous video showed y'all some of the fat squares that I found that they sell at Walmart for like three four dollars sometimes depending on the print well Dollar Tree got a hold of them and it's the freaking pink Florida Lee okay stop right now it's like they knew I was coming there were only two in the store only two they had but I'm going to be able to get two throw pillows out of this for my bed. My husband's so excited. <laughs> he is thrilled. But your girl is happy. I have seen this on Walmart's website and it's always sold out. They have the gray or they'll have the black. But you cannot find the pink. And then Dollar Tree wound up with the only two I need. And they have it. So, of course I got it. Um, next, I guess we'll go into, uh, oh, okay, so stationery. Okay, I've seen some people hauling these, and I hadn't seen them in my store, but of course I found them today. Today was like the lucky day, but it's the, uh, the, the snap envelopes, and they've had them in the two packs with the bigger one and the smaller one. I love these because I can use them for um, receipts or... Um, you know, if you've got a project coming up and you're trying to keep track of, of what you spend on it, you can keep this for the receipts and this one for the ideas, like the, if you clip stuff out or you print stuff out, whatever. Um, paint chips, um, away from home decor, you keep for recipes, for, I mean, schoolwork, you know, anything. There, it's so convenient. 
They also had this print, which I love, and it's the little butterflies, and with the, I love the colors with it. But um, two for a dollar is crazy because I, I always thought the, the just the one by itself was such a good deal, you know, because they're they're very well made. I've, I've bought these tons of times, but I've never gotten a smaller one with it. So I was super excited to get a hold of these. That's the only two colors that they had um, was the green and then the purple and pink. And then um, they had this. I've never seen this before. It's sticky notes. But it is like a little, it's in plastic, so it's not going to Velcro. But there's a little Velcro button here, that, or button, whatever, a little Velcro thing that'll keep it closed. But when you open it up, it's got the big notepad here, like a little shopping pad or shopping list, whatever, to-do list. And these are all individual sticky notes. So if you are, um, so if you're into the planning, like the Happy Planner, these actually are, are made to fit. Well, I don't know if they're made to, but they conveniently are laser cut to fit the Happy Planner spaces. Gosh. I, and I, I love my Happy Planner. I have the fitness one. I have the, um, I have one for my YouTube stuff. I have one for my home, my household stuff. I've got one for my boys for scouts. I've got like four separate ones and i've got my big i have the big happy planner and, um, i'm i'm a planner freak i love my planner and so this is perfect and like it fits in your in your pocketbook it fits inside the planner it fits in these envelopes you can use these for planning i mean they've got you covered but this i was so excited to find this because i have never i've never seen this in any of the stores so i, I snatched it up and I don't remember seeing any other color schemes. This was the only one I saw, or I would have grabbed it. Because I go through sticky notes like their water. Um, then they also had the the little sh the magnetic shopping pad. This is, I guess they're like their new spring or summer um, thing that they're going with. Is this um, almost like subdued rose teal and dark gray print. But they also have it in the little journal which is so cute. So they go together. This would be like perfect for like a, a teacher gift or even just like in a little, a, a few, like a girlfriend's gift, throw it in with like a bottle of wine, whatever. I will always be grateful if somebody gives me a magnetic list for my refrigerator because I'm constantly hollering down. If I'm getting ready to go to the store, I'm like, make me a list. If it's not on the list, I'm not gonna buy it. Make me a list, make me a list. And we go through them like crazy. And they're so hard to find with the magnetic strip on the back. So. I was excited to find this. And like I said, I always keep one of these in my purse because I'm always writing something down. So um, I was excited to find these to go together because they're super pretty. And it's not like your typical neon, stripey, whatever, whatever. These are so feminine and I love, love, love them. So I was excited to find them for sure. Oh, okay. So then over in the Crafter Square, I, I kind of skipped. I went from Crafter Square to journal stuff back to Crafter Square. But okay. I'm going to include at the end of this um, some, some film footage because I didn't buy it just because I don't need it. I may change my mind and go back and get it, but for right now, I couldn't think of anything I would, I would use it for, but I wanted to be able to show y'all that they have it. But they have an entire, entire section of the Heidi Swap stuff. I was floored when I saw it. Um, and I, my store doesn't have it, but I have seen other people showing like the marquee, light up marquee letters, the initials and the, um, like you can get the hashtag and the and sign, um, the at sign, all of those. My store does not have those yet. I have seen them in other people's videos. Um, but like I said, I'm going to attach some stuff to the end of this. So you'll be able to see kind of what I did or depending on how I edit this, I may include it. I may include it right here with a voiceover. I don't know. You're, you will see it in this video at some point. All I got from it was these two rolls of tape. Okay. They have like four or five different styles. They had this and like they had a black one, a black and white one that was vertical stripes. They had these in like the, the washi size, the standard washi size. This is washi tape, but it's the like almost two inches wide y'all. But now back to stationary. Like I said, I'm jumping back and forth and I'm fixing to bring my son in to do his teeny boo so I'm all over the place in this video but with, <laughs> oh, my husband is over there I did I should I introduced him he oh I thought you were talking about baby Yoda I introduced baby, baby. So you were shook. oh I was yeah I was shook y'all I was shook when I went to that truck and I saw baby Yoda in my truck all right um so I've got my son here Jaden and he is excited he's the one that I'm doing the little shelves for these here 
Um, you're making me shelves? You're going to have display shelves to put them on. Yeah. So he wants to open the teeny booths he with y'all. four teeny booths. He have four. So he's going to open them with y'all. Well, we first got this purple one. What series is it? Series I think we're still three. working with series three. Yeah, yeah, we got series three. They tape them down so well, it's hard to open. And then I just they'll come monster everywhere. in a green package <laughs> or any color. Do you scissors? No. Scissors. And we got, we got. Oh, we got the little Dalmatian. Dalmatian. What's his name? Oh. Yeah, it comes with a little. Here's a uh, card. It comes sheet, with the little sheet. And it sheet. says what their name is. The. This is Fetch. Yeah. This is Fetch. And I'm gonna show you the other four he did from the other previous trip. He couldn't wait for me to video it, so. He's already opened them, but I'll show them after he gets these done. So, so. the green one came with a yellow package. We're waiting on and we got it. a bear. <gasps> oh, I love the bear, y'all. It is actually before. fuzzy. His name is Crack. He has. Okay. Now, remind me at the end of this to tell them again. I've got something I want to tell y'all about his duplicates. What he wants to do with them. So, he, we've got <laughs> multiple duplicates. So, the cheetah. I forgot it. Y'all. The cheetah's name is, I should know this by now, is it Speckles or Speckles. Freckles? Speckles. Speckles. Yeah, Speckles. Speckles. Yeah. I'll be able to show this one. Get through that one. <laughs> we had two of her. This is Speckles, y'all. She's so cute. The last one we got another fetch. Okay, now see, that's the thing. Depending on what store you're at, they tend to have the same series over and over and over. There's three series. Um... And like I said, it'll show you on the card if you, you know, if you do end up getting some. It'll show you all of the and different ones. It'll tell back. you what series. This is all of the ones you can get. Um, we have run through series three with the exception of Chase, who is the mystery one. This one here, we don't have this one yet. But um, he, go get the other speckles. <laughs> you want to get all the ones you have? No. Okay. He's not going to get them. But anyway, he's got almost the entire collection of series three but look how cute these are going to be sitting on this they will sit like you can stagger them however you wanted to do it but um what we wanted to do since he has so many you know duplicates like this and like this <laughs> he's got two bears he's got two of these he's got about a million of these i will list in the description below in this video the multiples that he has and I will show a picture at the end of this video and he will hold up the ones that he's willing to to give away and as a giveaway and um, the only requirement is you have to be a subscriber to my channel you have to be 18 years or older <laughs> um, and you just have to leave me a comment and tell me which one you would like and it will be first come first serve and um, let me know which one you would like and then you can um, you can message me your address, you know, and then we can get it shipped out to you. But he wants to give them, you know, he doesn't want to hang on to them. There's no reason for him to have, like, 17 of the, the same about, <laughs> animal. Um, the cute thing about Cracker is that, like, he has a really small mouth. Yeah. The detail is so precious. As, and we do have two. I know we have at least two of this one. It's really bright because we have a lot and of And we have so. a lot of Neil the Seal. And um, so, like I said. Bye, guys. Um, says bye. Um, so, like I said, leave me a comment for which one you would like off of the list that I have. Um, subscribe to my channel, you have to be visibly subscribed, like this video, and um, leave me a comment telling me which one you would like, and I would be happy to send it to you free of charge, just because like I said, he wants to, let's give him away. He's my precious little boy who wants to share his toys. So um, yes, give away teeny boos. Okay, moving back into the hall. Okay, so, um, since regarding him, since we're moving right back into the hall, um, he is getting ready to have his 10th birthday this this month, actually, in a, in a few weeks. Um, so we're doing a, uh, a big, you know, thank God we can have people over finally party. And, and I mean, we're going to do a big deal because, like I said, it's his 10th birthday and it's, it's super, it's super special. We tend to do big parties in this family anyway. And this year he's doing a... Um, a YouTube themed party. His favorite YouTuber, Unspeakable, is who he's doing his party themed after. He's gonna have like little merch bags instead of goodie bags, and he's gonna have, um, you know, all the decorations like the hashtags and the um, at symbols and all of that. It, it's gonna be so precious. I will be sure and definitely show pictures and, and videos after he has his party. But I started picking up some of the decorations for it, 
and I have never seen these at Dollar Tree before. They, I've always seen like little pom-pom decorations that are made out of a tissue paper that are impossible to put together. They are beautiful in the displays. They are beautiful when they are professionally done. They are not a DIY decoration. I do not recommend that. They are so hard to do. But they came out with these. And they're just the fan type. And they're holographic. And they're beautiful. And they have the silver and the gold. So I did. I got four of these. I thought they were cute. We're going to hang them. Um, we've got four different points in our dining room we've Got the, with the columns that I'm going to hang them by. And so it'll just kind of, you know, I don't know. It doesn't really have anything to do with... Yeah, it's just gonna be sparkly bright and and you know his his channel themed is basically what we're doing but I just thought they were cute and they're gonna stand out so we did get these we're also gonna have like um, a, a big a video wall with a backdrop um, for like his channel backdrop and then we're gonna have I've got like the filter light boxes we're gonna have to actually add light for the party where his birthday cake and everything's gonna be the little present table and it's gonna be amazing I can't wait I'm super excited if I had another job in this life it would be party planning it, it truly would um, I I'd go all out that's probably I don't know if it's a downfall or if it's a blessing but my husband's always just like just let me know when to be there you, you do it so I'm excited for that. Um, and then again, to go in his merch bags, I've never seen these either. Um, they're the mini swirl lollipops. And, um, and they're like the, it's like the typical little, you know, swirly suckers. But they had the sour apple flavored. So the, they had this one and then they also have, they have the, the purple, pink, green, and orange colors. And then they also have the primary colors which is um, a, like a cherry flavor so we got these to throw you know to throw in with their little merch bags also so um, like I said we're just starting to kind of grab stuff little by little as we can so I was super excited about those it was so cute um, and then moving and like I said no certain order okay every single video I say how did they get that I need to start a series called how did they get that and open the video with that because I have purchased this within the last two months and it was eight dollars I know that because I get it for my my teenage son and I was thrown are you serious the four pack and the body sprays the four pack not individual the four pack this is normally these are normally two dollars a piece at walmart or target or walgreens whatever a dollar this is my i'm shook face because i don't know how they do it i don't know how they get it like is there something wrong with it that we need to know about um is uh, i mean i want to take it with me no, I don't, I guess I don't because I'll probably be like, you know, you need to pay for that. But I want to like check the number sometime and see if there's a difference between this one and the one at Walmart. I don't want to go pay $8 for the one at Walmart if it's the same thing or take a picture of it, I guess. Like, duh. Um, but I want to see if there's a difference, if it's like a different batch number. If, I mean, I'm sure it's a different batch number, but if it's like a different um, product number if it's a different manufacturer if there's some sort of a difference and if y'all know let me know tell me in the moment let me know because this is not a dollar at walmart it's not i know it's not because i buy it regularly i should have bought every single one on the shelf but i wasn't thinking my son just grabbed it and threw it in the buggy so sticking with um with with health care or skin care beauty aisles whatever i also grabbed this okay so i've never tried it i am an esthetician i'm very extremely picky about the products that i use on my on my body on, on what i use on my children and what i recommend for my husband or my friends or anybody extremely extremely picky um so i like to try the products that Dollar Tree carries, especially when it's the Dollar Tree brand. Um, but I'll compare ingredients a lot of times. I'll compare, you know, the additives and, and all that stuff. I, I don't buy a lot of, even high-end, I won't buy a lot of things if there's certain products in them. 
may obviously parabens or you know um but i want to try this because it's it's uh i mean it's the same exact ingredients as some of the um the acne cream that or acne wash that i have bought him that's like 30 and 40 dollars so um he's got beautiful skin but he does occasionally i mean he's 13 he's gonna break out from time to time um and so i I don't like to also I mean they have a they have a shelf life once they're opened especially when you're dealing with with face washes and face creams they have a shorter shelf life than you know typical cosmetics so if I can get some he's only gonna have to use like once every two or three weeks it's gonna last him for you know all six months versus it's gonna cost me a dollar so I will let y'all know I've never used this and if anybody has used this and you say no don't do it tell me before I put it on his face <laughs> but um, let me know if you've tried the foaming um, acne scrub because I'll be interested to uh, I don't want it if it's gonna dry them out I don't want that I don't want you know any of that any of those problems but I'm gonna try it out and see see how it does um, and, and with that I also grabbed one of these <laughs> y'all I don't know it could be a complete flop um, Sashi and Chic, they're hit or miss, but he's 13. He doesn't need a freaking $90 facial scrubbing brush. So I grabbed it for him to see, you know, see how they work. I've, I've told him numerous times that, you know, you use washcloth, but you gotta wash, you gotta scrub, you know, whatever. So we're gonna try them together and we're gonna see, and I will let y'all know. I'll give you a full review. Um, just takes two AA batteries. They did have it in like four or five different colors. They had this. They had this in the same colors as the uh, the nail tool that I talk about in a previous video. I think it's a video just before this. Actually, they have their um, nail shaping tool. I was telling you about. I hope this isn't as bad as that. <laughs> but they had like the green, the blue, the pink. Um, I want to say maybe an orange. I'm not sure. But anyway, I'll let you know. It's a really long description for that. But okay. And then these, of course, I grabbed these. I love these. I pick them up all the time. Um, I don't use them by themselves. I use them after I have already used my um, my other face wipes that I do to remove all of my makeup. I use the wipe to remove everything and then I come behind and I use these just to kind of, I don't know, one last swipe before bed. They're, they're very, very similar to the uh, Neutrogena ones. I have not, I, I can't complain. I've gone through about six packs of them. And it is the retinol cleansing cloths. Um, there's 30 in a pack, and they are very, very, very close dupe to the Neutrogena, in my opinion. Um, I grabbed this. I've, I haven't tried it. Um, I've seen a lot of people haul it. I've seen a lot of people talk about it. They have a lot of different um, flavors, a lot of different scents. I only saw this one, the cocoa butter one. Um, I have super crazy glossy gloss on right now, or else I would try it. I guess I can swipe it on my hand and see how it it feels um let's see. oh my gosh it smells just like their lotion my husband uses the cocoa butter lotion and oh that is smooth okay yeah i'm gonna like this okay um should have grabbed one for my sons too i will go back and get more of these um this is just the vaseline vaseline cocoa butter lip balm let's see if i can there we go um i will definitely be getting more of these then they can just, you know, throw it in their pocket. It's so smooth. Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Yes, I can already tell you I recommend this. But I mean, it's Vaseline, so there's not a lot by Vaseline I wouldn't recommend. Um, so yes for that. Uh, okay, y'all, my, my son's a turd. We had run out of Band-Aids, and my youngest, anytime he gets a cut, it is a bleed-out situation, in his opinion. It could be a paper cut. It could be... A, a hangnail it could be a jammed finger it could be an actual puncture wound but they're all identically the same and he needs close to surgery in his opinion <laughs> so we have we run through band-aids like crazy and I told my son I was like hey Tyrus go grab some band-aids real quick whatever you know just grab a box whatever I was in the checkout line I didn't want to get out really for my ten, almost 10 year old son. This is what he picked. Anyway, they're cute. They'll get used, but 20, 
fun designs, LOL surprise dolls for a non-girl child family. Oh well, that's what we'll use until we get more. I always get band-aids from Dollar Tree. Um, to me, a band-aid is band-aid. I'm not picky at all. I mean, slap it on there and stop the bleeding unless you need to go to the doctor. So, um, I think that might be it. I think, I think we got through it, y'all. I think we made it through it, and it's going to be under 30 minutes. Oh, in case anybody is wondering, I always do share with y'all um, which lashes I have been wearing because I get a lot of people ask me, you know, what lashes was that? What lashes was that? Um, they, of course, Ioni, the ones from Dollar Tree, of course. And these are the, these are from the previous, um, previous? <laughs> these are from the, uh, from the spring series, not the ones I just showed the case of the other day. These are from the spring series, um, but they're the Wispy Doll Crisscross. This is the box from them. Style number 68643 and it's the teal green, the darker teal. And like I said, it's just the wispy doll crisscross. And so that's the ones that I have on today. Love them. They're very bold. <laughs> They're one of the bolder pairs. Um, so like I said, if you're if you're interested in those, that's where I get them. I say it in every video. Ioni lashes. Multiple, multiple thumbs up. So um, that's it for this haul. Um, like I said, if you made it this far, you're a trooper, and I'm excited that you stayed. Um, if you are still here and you didn't like it, I mean, I don't know why you're here. I say that in every video, too. So, um, like I said, if you want uh, to get in on the giveaway, if you want to get in on the giveaway, um, like the video, subscribe to my channel visibly, and drop a comment and let me know which one you would like. I will have a list of everyone that's available. Um, and first come first serve uh one per per comment or one per subscriber please um but yeah he will be happy to to send those to y'all so if you're new subscribe if you want a teeny boo subscribe and like and um i will see y'all in my next haul bye guys Mwah. so these were the new wood planks that they had from the Heidi Swap line and it just kind of shows different things you can do with them with the rest of the things in her line. There's her website if you want to check out the rest of it. They didn't have any letters at our store. Um, and then this is the Crafter Square new monogram gemstones they had. They were kind of thrown in there with it so you could definitely join these with the Heidi Swap stuff as well. They had about four different colors I believe will come up in the rest of this video. And this was the, the border gemstones as well, the same Crafter Square line. They had about four different colors in this one, pink and gold for sure also. Now this is kind of her cardstock um, multi-media pack you can get. There's about six or seven different prints in there. They were all very thick cardstock and it can be used individually. You could use them as cards, scrapbooking. You could use them as planner covers if you have the hole punch. Limitless ideas with these. I was really shocked to see these in our store. This was the only set they had. And then they did have this set as well as far as the mixed media. This is more of the cardboard with fabric covering. Um, this again was the only one that we had in our store, but there are others I know out there. And it just gives you the project ideas on the back of this one as well. And there's her website and different ideas for what you can do with it. Now here is our new sticker selection they've put up. They've got the cross stitch sets. There was uh, butterfly, hearts, and frogs. That was the only three that we had, but they have a ton of new Crafter Square stickers and rub-on transfers. These are the ones pictured earlier in the video. Um, these work great for planners, for pocket letters, note cards, invitations, you name it. Really, there's an unlimited number of things you could do with them. And then here's the monogram stickers again, the strips and the, um, the ribbon ones as well. So they've really kind of stepped up their game on the Crafter Square sticker selection. Now this again is the rest of our Crafter Square section. It's not always that neat, but they do have quite a bit of new um, items in stock that were new to our store anyway, especially this new craft glue here. I've never seen that before. Um, of course, we have the regular canvases and the wood decor. 
the little crates. I love, love, Make sure love. you hit the bell so that you stay up to date on all of my latest uploads and videos. Also, follow me on Instagram at jwaltmua or check out my website, jennywalton-artistry.com.